TFL Live last night. Week 13 got underway in Winnipeg, and it was good news for the Blue Bombers, who beat the BC Lions impressively 26-14. to But the game ended on a real sour note, and you can have a look here as to why. This was late in the game. Damon Allen took a shot, definitely a late hit by free safety Robert Davis of the Bombers. Blatant late hit. The flags come out. And then the fighting starts, too. Take another look at it. Allen down. The Lions have already lost this game, and Robert Davis, for good measure, giving him a solid pop. And then you can see the frustrations. Louis Pasaglia would even get involved a little bit and challenging Davis later on to come over and settle this thing. But no love loss between these two teams. And this was in the dying moments. This is after the game. Adam Rita looking for Jeff Reinbold to make his point, and finally he finds him. And look at this. Gives him the shove. Reinbold seems a bit surprised by it all. Grant Carter gets involved, and then he's soon thrown. And afterwards, Reinbold talked about it and said he didn't know exactly what Adam Rita's problem was with all this. Apparently, Adam, Adam thought Robert Davis took a shot at his guy, and he comes over and pushes me. But, you know, again, that just says an awful lot. I don't have to say anything. His actions spoke louder than anything I could ever say. It doesn't spoil the victory? No, not at all. Not, he can't. Nobody can take this. Nobody can spoil this because, I mean, hey, it's his trip, not mine, you know. So he's got to live with himself. Well, Adam Rita thought, and all of us thought, and it was a fact. He did give him a cheap shot. I don't think there's any arguing that. But Marty... A bit of a history here, maybe, and maybe another reason why Winnipeg was so upset. Well, first of all, Rod, I want to say that that was the worst cheap shot that I've seen since Rocket Ismail stepped on Andy McVeigh's head in 1992. <laughs> I, that was ugly. But the Bombers think, and a few of them, I should say, because I talked to a few of them today, and they think... they <laughs> think have to be a tiny few, Marty. <laughs> they think that David Benefield took a cheap shot at, at Vargas earlier in that game. And... Uh, by hitting, uh, Benefield hit Vargas' head oh, a clean with his hit. helmet. Just now, a clean hit. This is what they said, and uh, they said they were trying to get back later on. Anyway. Well, I think that's a bunch of crap, because to me, that's a perfect blitzing linebacker, and that's what he should do to a quarterback. But, you know, and, 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 I will say this. In the NFL, you, uh, if a guy rushes and he, his helmet hits this isn't the face the NFL. Of, a, of a quarterback, it's an automatic penalty. This isn't and, the NFL. And, and plus, this is football, contact football. <laughs> so that hit is legal. Damon Allen slid for five yards, was ready to get up, go home, and this guy comes and hits him late. Well, Les, you may be right, and I won't shove you, okay? But, <laughs> but I, well, what I want to say also is that there is a history between Rita and Reinbold. I mean, there was a lot of bad blood between these two guys before the season even began. When, when uh, Reinbold took to uh, Winnipeg, Carthon and Hamilton and some other free agents that were with BC before, and Rita was very upset about that at that time. I still don't think that has anything no, to do with it. No, well, party. I think it just added you to You know, it. what has to do with is that that's your starting quarterback, and if he gets hurt, your season is through. Right. I think that's what Adam Rita was actually thinking about when he, after the game, when he went to go look for Ryan Bolt, he was thinking about Mike's, my career, my season was almost done well, because of a dumb play. There's another thing he was thinking about. He thinks that there is a uh, history that uh, Ryan Bolt has about taking ban giving uh, as bounty rewards to players. Now, I, I use, I'm going to use the word bounty. Now, let's face it. When he was with Las Vegas, there was a lot of talk. I'm talking about Reinbold. There was a lot of talk that he would uh, give out bounty oh, rewards to players who true. would nail people. So did Robert Davis collect the reward? Virgil Robertson no. said in the, in the paper that he heard there was a, re a bounty out on Damon Allen yesterday. Well, I know that Ryan Bolt did give out incentives for players to go out and knock people on their butts on special teams when he was right. in B.C. Uh, I can't see him telling a guy to go over there and hit Damon Allen way after he's been on the ground for five seconds. No, in fact, either. Jeff Ryan Bolt himself said that that was a dumb play on Robert Davis's part because it could have hurt his football team. What if they'd have went in and scored and got an onside kick or something like yeah. that? So he wasn't happy about that, but... Uh, you know, uh, football is an emotional game, as we said earlier, <laughs> and sometimes you lose it, and obviously Adam Rita did.